in a move that could escalate tensions between President Assad's forces and the U.S. Syrian military have said there are a number of casualties after a U.S. airstrike targeted a military position in Al Hari southeast of Al Bakamal in Dayretzer. There are unconfirmed reports there were also Hezbollah and Iranian forces at the military base. A commander in the military alliance backing the Syrian president, Bashar al-Assad said drones, probably American, had bombed positions of Iraqi factions between al-Bukamal and Tanf and Syrian military positions. A Middle East correspondent said, Syrian forces killed in an international coalition raid on a military site south of al-Bukamal. The U.S. has denied any involvement in the attack. Major Josh Jock, a U.S. Central Command spokesman said, no member of the US-led coalition carried out strikes near al-Bukamal. The US-led coalition is supporting an alliance of Syrian Arab and Kurdish militia fighting Islamic State northeast of al-Bukamal. The Syrian army, alongside allied Iran-backed militias including Lebanon's Hezbollah and Iraqi groups, pushed ISIS out of al-Bukamal and its environs last year. But the jihadists have since attacked the area. U.S. forces are also based in Tanf, southwest of Al Bukamal in the Syrian desert near the borders of Iraq and Jordan. Last week, Assad said he regarded the U.S. as an occupying power in Syria and the position of his state was 